No, I don't think you put you at high risk of getting COVID. I think COVID being a novel infection is very infectious, meaning that we don't have the resistance against it. Uh, if you come in contact with it, there's a good chance that you'll come down with it. So having asthma doesn't put you at an increased risk of getting COVID, but it does uh, put you at a disadvantage for whatever respiratory conditions that you may contract. So for example, if you end up with a pneumonia and you have asthma on board, and if your asthma is not well controlled, then you'll be dealing with two things separately. You'll be, I mean, together as in, you're dealing with the asthma, you're dealing with the pneumonia. Other people will be dealing with just the pneumonia, but you'll deal with two things. So the uh, postulation is that if you're asthma is regularly well controlled, then the extra pneumonia wouldn't put too much a strain on your respiratory system. Whereas if your asthma is you know, on a baseline, on a daily basis, is very poorly controlled, then what happens is that you, you're already dealing with this and something new come on board, you'll be at a, a, a greater disadvantage. And the worry often is that the patients might have run into breathlessness and might end up requiring an ICU support. Asthma itself can uh, cause a patient to end up in the ICU requiring a mechanical ventilation. What more if you throw in a respiratory condition like COVID or a haste situation where by trigger off the asthma and make you worse? I would say that uh, if you have asthma, you are at a, you're always at a higher risk of having complications. But that doesn't necessarily mean that you'll be worse off. If your asthma is well controlled, you take your regular inhalers every day, then there's a good chance your asthma may not come into play when uh, you have a subsequent infection. A lot of my patients now uh, take their illnesses more serious, you know, make sure they are well controlled, uh, make sure they take their medicine regularly. So I think that is an opportunity for them to reinforce their compliance to the preventive medicine, which is a pillar of treatment for asthma. So uh, whenever there's an opportunity like, like the haze, like COVID, I'll remind them better keep your asthma well controlled. And then if they are unwell, come back and see me earlier so that we can actually catch the asthma early and really prevent that severe attack that might end up in the intensive care.